Hi there. Uh, welcome to a uh, one technology overview of Cisco Umbrella. Uh, today, Andy Lambert um, from the one technology team will be overviewing the Cisco Umbrella product uh, security enforcement solution uh, leveraging DNS. Andy, take it away. Hi, everyone. As Matt mentioned, I'm a solution architect for One Technology. Here to do a quick overview of the Cisco Umbrella solution. Here at One Technology, we've identified several uh, umbrella key takeaways. Number one, starting with flexible security protection on and off network, better performance and user satisfaction everywhere, consistent policies across remote locations, and multiple security functions in a single security device. One of the largest key takeaways also when it comes to our deployment experience with the Umbrella product is it's relatively ease of deployment in the first place. So why does Umbrella leverage DNS um, as an enforcement mechanism? Primarily because everything starts with DNS. It precedes file execution, used by all devices, and is port agnostic. Where does Umbrella really shine? Primarily around malware, things like ransomware and C2 callbacks, and then additionally phishing. So at this point, I'd like to run through a very quick demo. Um, primarily, uh, we'll be covering the following items. Security overview, a breakout of security blocks by destination, identity, or type, any connect integration for remote roaming users, which does not require any type of VPN connectivity, but allows for that uh, traditional enterprise uh, content enforcement, even while a user is working remotely. And then finally, deployment flexibility with option to deploy virtual appliances within the customer infrastructure. And as I mentioned previously, a quick deployment model that typically only takes a couple of hours. So this is the, the initial screen when it comes to the Cisco Umbrella um, appliance solution. Um, this is an overall overreaching complete insight into the overall traffic, DNS resolution requests, things along those lines within the Umbrella deployment. Um, as we scroll down, we can see a summary count of a number of different uh, valuable insight uh, from a general standpoint. Uh, we have clearly how many active networks we have within the umbrella deployment, active roaming clients, and then to my point earlier that was discussed around active virtual appliances. We also have some insight into the actual active network tunnels. As we scroll through, we can see total requests processed from, a, from an umbrella standpoint, proxy requests, total blocks, and security blocks themselves. Um, one focal point that I wanted to make sure that uh, we brought some clarity to was as mentioned in the previous slide, most block security requests can be broken down into three individual types, um, by destination, by identity, and by the type of request themselves. Um, this does offer, as you'll see here, complete Cisco AMP integration, as well as complete integration with the additional portfolio, broad portfolio from a security standpoint that Cisco has to offer. Here we have additional insight into roaming computers themselves. We highlight domain management from uh, an Active Directory integration standpoint, so the ability to map users, uh, groups, things along those lines, and direct integration with an Active Directory um, from a traditional Windows um, standpoint. We have the ability to map and essentially provide specific destination lists based on category and the flexibility to choose which particular content we're actually filtering from a DNS standpoint, all categorically, all with a simple slide as far as uh, enabling or disabling the overall category itself, in addition to more, more granular control. Customized block page apparent, appearance, so highly uh, valuable from an enterprise standpoint when it comes to enforcement of perhaps bad requests from a user browsing standpoint. And then finally, uh, pretty robust, very robust um, reporting infrastructure when it comes to all the flexibility that we can essentially generate and um, gain insight into the actual traffic within the environment. 
here we have a more granular breakdown of the actual requests going out. Um, top destinations, top categories, top identities hit within the umbrella environment. So as mentioned, this is relatively quick deployment, super easy to stand up from a um, proof of concept standpoint. Currently, Cisco is offering a 14-day trial on Cisco Umbrella. And with current events the way they are, they're also extending, uh, if you reach out to Cisco as part of that 14-day trial, an additional 90 days tacked onto the Umbrella trial. Um, really appreciate everyone's time. I look forward to talking to you. Thank you. Thank you, Andy.